You look fantastic. You look very friend. dapper. I feel good. I feel good. Yeah, my, uh, my stylist. We got a little Valentino going here tonight. I heard you're excited about the animals. I'm very excited. I'm extremely excited about the animals. Are you an animal lover? I'm a general? huge animal lover. I can't. I, I was. I was. When I was a kid, I was going to be a veterinarian. That was number one. That was the job. Wow. Remember the, t the TV show BJ and the Bear? Of course. That was like my favorite TV show. Anybody here over forty? Yeah. Right <laughs> over 40. <laughs> Yeah, I wanted to be uh, wanted to be BJ. I wanted to be a truck driving veterinarian. That was what I wanted. <laughs> and, then, and then I found out math was involved. I'm like, screw it. No, right, never mind. <laughs> I don't live in Argentina, so you know. <laughs> right. The kids there are brilliant. They're, brilliant, they're all brilliant, geniuses. Brilliant, yeah. It's great. They come out of the womb with a book in their hands. <laughs> Sometimes it's unfortunate because <laughs> sometimes. The the corners of the book will actually get caught in the fallopian right, tube. Right, exactly, right, exactly, yeah. <laughs> You're on the umbilical, let me get this umbilical cord up, right? Yes, did you have pets growing up? Were you, uh... Uh, uh... Yeah, as, as a kid, we had dogs. I, 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 there was never a time in my life when I didn't have a dog. I had a dog from the time I was a, in, a, in a walker. I dogs to, only, though, right? Yeah, only dogs and a few cats. We had a couple of cats. And then uh, it, it evolved a bit. When I got older, I, uh, when I was in graduate school, my roommate and I had, at one point in time, in a 500-square-foot apartment, Nine birds. <laughs> uh, we had we had a black-capped conure, a Senegalese parrot, four parakeets or budgies, if you will. We had a ball <laughs> python, a uh, a Chinese water dragon. Um, we had a sand lizard. We had um, a ferret and a kitten. And at one point in time, for one week, we had a corgi, a Welsh corgi. And because I know you were all guessing, wondering, <laughs> is it a cardigan or a Welsh? <laughs> and, and then and then and then of course the commensurate. Rats and frozen rats and uh, and mice that we had to feed to the snakes. In the oh my God! And oh, and a Nile a Nile monitor. So yes, I'm excited about the reptiles that are going to be here tonight. <laughs> excited! You had all those animals. Yeah, all those animals. That's un unbelievable. Yeah, yeah, it was crazy. Yeah, we're, 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 we were uh, me and my friend Tyler. We're, we were at Marlon Perkins household. Yeah, no yeah. kidding. Yeah, yeah. When well, like when girls would come over, would the girls come over? I was, <laughs> <laughs> Every now and a girl, a girl would come over, and the, the, the phrase that was probably most often used in the apartment was like, "Don't go in the refrigerator." <laughs> don't go in the refrigerator. The girl would be like, "I'm just gonna get some ice for my no! like, <laughs> Just dead rats. <laughs> like, wow. Yeah. And yeah. you, I learned this about you today, and I didn't realize this, but you hosted a show on Animal Planet. I hosted the Planet's Funniest Animals on Animal Planet. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Where was it? The host. Like, I guess. I think I, I think I, it was one. I, I think uh, 2006, like 2006, 2007. So it was like after Mad TV. It was during Mad TV. On my TV. hiatuses, I could shoot like you know, I could shoot like 50 episodes. It's just like, guys, wait till you see this penguin take this belly flop, change sweaters. Hey guys, <laughs> this giraffe's really sticking his neck out. <laughs> change sweater. You could just do. You know. And did you determine in that time on that show what is the world's funniest animal? World's funniest animal? Yeah. Hands down, not even a contest. Anytime a, champ, uh, a chimpanzee is smoking a cigarette, yep. or has been administered peanut butter, so it goes, and we make it look like it's talking. Yeah. <laughs> in, in a tuxedo, whilst playing drums. <laughs> so, there we go. Yeah. I will add one more thing, is yeah. that a chimpanzee is one of very few animals that will intentionally throw their feces at people yes. who are watching them. Yes. And that's always funny, too. You can't lose. <laughs> you really can't lose. I mean, poop is the funniest thing. Can you imagine this poop? Like, I feel like they're, they're, they're trying to do comedy, and sometimes they're running out of jokes, and they get desperate. They just go, I don't know. I have nothing. Poop. <laughs> <laughs> I've been known to do that a couple of times myself. <laughs> if you like that video, then put a ring on it. Click the subscribe button below. Uh-oh. Oh. oh.